Hey, what's going on YouTube? Grass Nectar in the house, man. Um, I'm up early today because it's gonna be a monster of a day, all right? I'm gonna be making around $700 today as a solo lawn care provider. Stick around with me and you can see how I do it all, all right? I'm gonna start real early, it's 6.37. First property, I'm gonna start it at seven. It's early, um, but you know, that she goes to work at 7.30, she wants me to be done by then. You know, um, most of the times people turn these properties down, but I take advantage uh, because you can always upcharge because you're coming like early or, or coming at a special time or special request. So, you know, turn a negative to a positive and that's how you can uh, make make good money, man. You know, sell your services, upcharge your services accordingly, okay? I'm gonna try to record, but man, I'm, I'm, I'm gonna be busy. I'm not gonna lie. I got um, three on the list only. And as you guys know, I'm a part-time mowing man, you know. Um, so I also have a call center job, which I use the personal day for. So that alone right there puts me up $250 right off the bat using a personal day. That's the advantages of uh, working, <clears throat> of doing this, you know, part-time. You still have a full-time job that, that brings income and you know it's that time of the year where you can take days off now i mean like you have to use them before you lose them basically you know i have sick days i have personal days at my job and if i don't use them they they go to waste so um definitely gonna take advantage of that this next couple days to do leaf cleanups to do personal things for myself i sent an email earlier today check it out Bing. email sent um i let my my um the people that i need to know you know that i wasn't coming in today and um you know i'm out here took on a couple jobs uh scheduled them um a while back i was prepared for this day i knew that i needed this day off and here i am baby i'm about to make that 700 dollars day as a solo lawn care provider okay i'm proud of that because man i mean you gotta celebrate these early victories okay but enough jabbering, let me get driving here to my first property and then uh, we'll go from there, right? Peace. All right, YouTube, we're at the first property here and um, I'm about to open the gate and see what I signed up for. Um, this is a loyal customer and uh, Wow, there's a lot of leaves here, man. Definitely more than I expected um, You know, I she's been a customer for me for a while she um, Wants to always be home, you know, it's one of those uh, special needs customers man But she's been with me for a while and it's some it works out for me. So I, I still have her um, Basically we agreed do the best I can for 30 minutes and then just um, you know she had to leave at uh, 5 30 so you know it, when she leaves I leave so you know wish me luck let's see what I can do in 30 minutes a few moments later all right so here are the results did the best I could for 30 minutes went at it hard and um, you know th these are the results you know it it's not ideal to do it this way because you know i i don't think it's a good job i think this is a very poor cleanup but for the time i was given you know that's kind of what you get you know um but you know at, at the end of the day no matter what you or i think if the customer is happy that's all that matters right um and definitely she was happy she let me know that I did a great job and um, you know let's go on to the next one all right you too what's going on man just got done with that yard that was a $50 yard now don't get it twisted all right it's $50 for a reason because me and the homeowner agreed 
that in 30 minutes I would do the best work that I could and that's what I did mulched up as best as I could got there at 7 mulched up as best as I could finished at 7 30 and then the owner can go to work happy and she loved the work that I did okay so that's what it's all about um, check out the text message the proof is in the pudding all right actually I just um, I'm at Russo right now you guys can't see Russo power equipment got some uh, Halloween candy that they gave me and they also gave me this hat Russo Toro that high-vis hat for the winter all I needed was this uh, this little oil man um, I have about a full full tank I just don't want to run out cuz uh I got a pretty big uh, cleanup next and um, you know it would be unfortunate to to run out on the job so um, got that little thing for one gallon in case I need it I started at 7 for that lady because she needed it and her um, neighbors are cool and um, you know that's what we agreed on and it was her backyard so kind of private property there uh, so no noise complaints and things like that so but now we can actually mow other people's yards I got a tear out that I got to do a landscape tear out and I got a uh, clean up all right so come along with me I'll try to record it but I'm gonna be hustling and bustling all right peace All right, YouTube, we're here at the second property. Um, just a little tip. Whenever you're have to, whenever you doing fall cleanups and you have to meet the uh, the customer, bring face wipes, man, because you, you got a bunch of uh, dirt and stuff. Ain't nobody want to talk to someone like that, man. So take care of yourself, clean your face, and talk to these customers, all right? So this one's going to be a uh, fall cleanup, bagging up the leaves. And then we're going to tear um, the front of her landscape. She wants to redo it next year. All right. So that's what we're going to do. I'll walk you through the property. Not sure if I'm going to record, but uh, it is what it is. All right. All right, you too. So what we have here is a baby cleanup. I love these little cleanups, man, because they're easy and it's still, you know, double the charge for a mow. Uh, so on my left hand side is a flower bed that we're tearing completely out everything that you see here I'm gonna dig it up and haul away Minus this bush this little lilac bush. She wants to keep that. It's got great shape. I would keep it too All right, so just gonna show you the backyard here. I fertilize do we control uh, For this lawn. So it's a great customer uh, credit card on file so pays on time you know, I definitely love this customer here, man. I got, I got much appreciation for this customer here. So I'm going to do my best job that I can get this yard looking great. Uh, I'm also going to, you know, clean this little flower bed up a little bit as best as I can. And yeah, man, I mean, standard cleanup below the leaves in the middle of the yard. Go over them once with the, with the lawnmower and then the second time bag it up. And then this is just, I'm just showing you this alley here. I mean, nothing special here. Nothing really to look at. Um, so yeah, man, I'm, I'm excited for this one. It's going to be a good, good day, man. It's been cold lately in Chicago, but man, the sun came out today. And that's one thing about Chicago, man. When the sun comes out, everybody's out, man. So many people are out walking. It's a damn good day today, man. Love it. All right, so hopefully this uh, flower bed doesn't give me any trouble. I pray that it doesn't, man. Sometimes those root balls are so, you know, in the ground that it's, it's hard to dig them out. We'll see, man. I'm going to have to, you know, roll up my sleeves and just get go to town on it. But you're going to see this flower bed clear it out. Uh, that's the mission, you know. Clear it out. Level the soil. And that's it, man. I mean, collect that check. <sighs> Long care is a hell of a drug, man.
All right, YouTube world, check it out. Those are the end results of Grass Neck to Lawn Care, man. It wasn't easy, but it sure was fun, man. Just because it's not easy, man, doesn't mean you can't have fun. I honestly did have fun here. Looks great. Ready to plant some new new landscape. You know what I'm saying? Um, I may send her a design. I got some ideas for this landscape, bud. You know, some low maintenance, some easy, some beautiful for every, you know, occasion. Uh, we'll see if she goes for it. And maybe next year, who knows? You may see a video of me planting stuff here. Um, I like doing garden design stuff, man. So uh, definitely will send her an email with my thoughts. Uh, but check out the backyard. Looking beautiful, looking clean. Looks like it, it looks like I inspired the neighbor over there to, you know, get off Granny's couch and start mowing his own yard. Uh, but check it out, man. Clean and beautiful, and I mean that's that's what that's why I get paid the big bucks, man. Because I I I take my time and I do good work, man. And you should too. That's one thing about being a solo lawn care provider, you know. Your work speaks for itself, and you can make sure you're doing the best work because you're the only one out there doing it, you know? Um, so check out the the other side here. You see the neighbor's you know, yard has a bunch of leaves. Not my, not my properties, man. Um, so this one was a fun one, and, um, you know, definitely, definitely good, man. Enjoyed it a lot. So I'm about to wrap up. Yeah, uh, and, and is bounce, real man. Over here, bro. Support is real over here. Woo! What's going on, YouTube? Ah, man, just finished that job. Feeling great, feeling good, man. Um, basically, we did a tear out of the front landscape. Besides one bush that she likes, it's a really nice lilac. We left it in there. I tore everything out and leveled the soil as best as I could. So now that that place is ready for planting next year. And man, now I'm up to, let me see, that was 200 for the tear out and $50 for the cleanup, all right? So now my total is, all right? Stick with me. I'm gonna show you how to make this money as a part-time mowing man, all right? Let's do it. All right, what's going on YouTube? I'm here at my house. What I'm gonna do is I'm gonna take some of these branch, these big branches out so I can uh, burn them and I have room for the next cleanup, all right? So that's what I'll be doing. All right, YouTube, so got the wood there. I burned it tonight. Let's go on to this fall cleanup, man. This estimate yesterday, those branches were not there. That's bogus. You just freaking cut them out. Clock in. A few moments later. 
finished up this property YouTube. That's how they feel, man. All right, so this is the property that I just finished. Man, it was fun, not gonna lie. It was a great time. There it is. There it is, ladies and gentlemen. That's a nice looking house right there. Good job, Grass Nectar. Good job. All right, YouTube. You chilled with me. You saw how I made this money. This much. It's a part-time hustle, man. Not gonna lie, it's hard. It is difficult. It's not for the week, but the mo money's out here, man. You just gotta be clever. Maneuver your schedule. Manipulate that schedule and, and just make it work for you. You know? The 9 to 5 is ain't, ain't that bad, man. I mean, I like my 9 to 5. I'm a call center manager if you don't know. I'm trying to drive over here. And I enjoy the work that I do. It's taught me a lot of like lessons and the CEO of my company, of the company I work for, is amazing, man. He teaches me a lot of things and you know I, I'm learning. Um, when I outgrow that, when Grass Nectar takes off and when I don't need that job anymore, you know, I'm gonna hang up my re my hat respectfully because it's been a great company, and um, you know, do lawn care full time because I I enjoy doing this stuff, man. Um, it, it felt so different, you know, being out here, not having to worry about the call center, because uh, usually if I you know don't take a day off, and I I do like um, lawns, I have a computer here that I connect to Wi-Fi, but I'm constantly checking it because people are constantly you know asking for me and needing things you know I, I have a bunch of meetings that I that I have to go to and things like that so to be able to forget about all that and just do lawn care kind of opens my eyes and it makes me realize that you know lawn care is where I want to be but I'm gonna I'm gonna take it slow I mean not this year not next year maybe the year after but I'm slowly building my my repertoire I got my truck I got my right stander, I got the bagger, I got the X Mark, I got the Honda, I got the Echo PAS225, I got the PAS2620. So I'm slowly building my, my team up, man, you know? And um, my full time job is helping me pay for my family and my bills and everything. And then lawn care pays for everything else pays for the truck, pay for pays for taxes insurance uh that's all money from lawn care man and that's that's great man you know what i'm saying so thank you so much for watching hopefully you enjoyed sorry i couldn't get any actual footage but man like trust that i did the work that i did and you can obviously see man the results speak for themselves all right and with that said grass next signing out peace but hey what do I know? I'm just mowing grass.